going to be in 10 years? What kind of player are you going to be? 10 years, I want to be uh, you know, known as a, a true professional, a guy that played the game the right way. Um, you know, hopefully still in the league and, and still effective in the league. There's not many people that, that last in double digit years. So uh, it starts now and building a foundation for the later on down the road. We all talk about, you know, who's the GOAT? And the reality is it's all subjective. But the one thing that isn't subjective when you talk to anyone is who's the greatest shooter ever. There is no debate. Stephen Curry. He's a marksman like we've never seen before. The shots he makes is like, how's he even real? And every time I'm on the couch and he takes a crazy shot, I always say, that's not going to go in. And it goes in. Curry, way down to bang, bang! He's hands down the best shooter to ever play this game. Curry for the lead. What he's done with shooting the basketball, I don't think anybody ever envisioned it could conceivably happen. The way he's able to bring so much joy to the game, the way he's changed the game, couldn't be a more deserving leader on the top of the three-point list. Puts it in at the buzzer! Oh, man! Anytime you break a league record, especially one that has names like Ray Allen at the top, it's just incredibly impressive. Ray is arguably one of the greatest shooters of all time, our generation. But there's a new gunslinger coming down the pipe, and he goes by the name of Stephen Curry. This is something you can't debate. This is in the stats. It's in the record books. When you're talking the GOAT shooter, that's Steph and the way he's changed the game. He's walking away. I don't think we've ever seen anything like it, and I'm not sure we'll see anything like it again. Yes, sir. All right, I just officially got butterfly. I'm out of my element now. In terms of speculation, there's no argument that Steph Curry's the best shooter available in this draft. And the question is, can he make the transition to the point guard spot? Is he going to be strong enough against NBA defenders over the course of an 82-game schedule? Curry, three, yeah! Being a small guard out of Davidson, 21-year-old Stephen Curry was out to prove himself in a league that thrived off of bigs and points in the paint. With the seventh pick in the 2009 NBA Draft, the Golden State Warriors select Stephen Curry from Davidson College. In his first NBA season, from Davidson, number 30, Stephen Curry! Under the guidance of Coach Don Nelson, it didn't take long for the new warrior to find his group. We were still under the radar as a team when I first got here, and nobody really expected much, and I could kind of just focus on getting better. Curry straight on, takes a three. Nothing but net for Steph Curry. As Curry hits again, now that's what they were talking about. One of the pure shooters you're ever going to see coming out of college. Went through some injuries, didn't know if I was going to be you know, healthy enough to play night in, night out. Curry pulls up for three. Good! But kept the confidence, worked through the rehabs, got out there, was healthy again, was able to experience the playoffs a couple times. Won a championship. I'm just going to sit here for a second. <laughs> develop a new identity around what it means to be a warrior, and then the fight and journey to stay on top, chase more championships. For you, Domination, baby! The whole thing! The individual accolades are pretty cool, too, but it's all kind of, you know, the, the cool arc of a, of a career. And through the championships, MVPs, all-star games, Steph was changing the game one shot at a time. He deserves all the praise because he truly has changed the game of basketball. Hand off Curry, takes another three, it's up and good! Three-point shot is now such a premium in the game. You can thank Stephen Curry for that. And one, Curry deep three, good! 
continuing to change the way the game was played. He just made it cool to go out there and have fun and bouncing around at 6'3", not being the, 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 the tallest guy on the floor. Well, he's breaking all these records while he's still in his prime. At the start of the 2021 season, a new accolade was on the horizon. With 2,495 career three-pointers, Curry was 65 threes away from passing his childhood idol, Reggie Miller, on the all-time made three-pointers list. My favorite player growing up was Reggie Miller, actually. My dad was obviously my favorite player. He loved to see my pops play, but uh, I loved watching Reggie, just the way he moved on the court and big shots he hit, and he was just fearless. Anytime you uh, watched him on TV or if I was lucky enough to be in the building when they were playing, every time they shot it, I thought it was going in. People that I looked up to as a, as a young kid playing the game, obviously with my dad, sparked the love of shooting the basketball. And to look up on the list, and obviously I want to catch him and, and put together many more years at this pace, but just knowing those two guys are right in front of me, it's a special moment for sure. It's cool to be able to inspire the next generation, obviously. You know, I used to chase his dad around screens so often and elbow Dale all the time. You know, when he's going home, you know, <laughs> Steph is like, hey, you be kind to Reggie now. Reggie was a big guy. Growing up, we both watched just the way he moved about the basketball, the way he played with the joy and the, the confidence he played with. From the time I started playing basketball, you know, on organized teams when I was nine, to now, there's been many chapters and iterations of the way that I shoot, the way that I play, and I've embraced every single part of that, of that journey. Heading into Utah tonight, Stephen Curry may take one more step up the ladder of NBA history. He's now four threes away from passing his childhood idol, Reggie Miller, among the all-time three-point leaders. Wiggins up top. Curry takes a handoff, takes a three on the way. Got it. Oh, man, that was tough. Curry, another one. Curry fires, hits a three up top, move over Reggie Miller. Curry has tied Reggie Miller right there. There it is. 2,560. Off the screen, Curry dribbles in, cruising the baseline, hook pass to Draymond, back to Curry. Quick release, Curry it's up. is now second all time. There he goes. Stephen Curry is now second place all time in the three point caravan. That quick release is unmatched, and now he's number two all by himself in three-pointers made. 2,561, only Ray Allen has made more in the NBA. After dealing with a tough loss, Reggie Miller made a surprise appearance to congratulate Steph on surpassing his record. Number one, congratulations. This is an unbelievable achievement, but the work is not done. Obviously, I know you're chasing Ray, but you are an inspiration to so many little ones uh, like mine. And I'm just so proud of all the work because I know what goes into that. The Millers are very proud of you, especially this little guy. Um, he is your number one fan. So thank you so much for what you have done, my friend. It's kind of cool to see how the game has evolved, how he has evolved to become the greatest shooter of all time. and for me to play a very small part in that, because to me it was you know, the parents' upbringing on why his whole family is the way they are. I'm very fortunate that I was even you know, on Stefan's radar. How much longer until you break Ray Al's three-point record? I mean, you're, you're in, the, in the booth right now, so it's your job to know these stats, to be able to do the quick math. And uh, you're, Sammy. Supposed to, you're supposed to be able to tell me. I don't know where Sammy's at. You're supposed He's supposed to, to punch the numbers. Uh, what do you think, 40 games? It's it's, he's 400 behind Clay. Oh, oh shoot. <laughs> Two seasons. It's going to be longer Season than that. Season and a half. <laughs> the rate Steph was going, it was never a question of if he would eventually pass Ray Allen's record, but when. Curry backs up an open three look from downtown. It's good. The three-point record has always been something I've 
have looked at and kept track of and understand you know, the longevity that is required to reach those heights. Draymond Green out to Curry, quick release and a splash for Stephen Curry. What Ray Allen has done, stretching the imagination of what it means to shoot the three-pointer and make it a pivotal and important part of your game. I've taken that confidence and run with it. To have the opportunity to eclipse Ray on the list is a humbling feeling and something that I will really appreciate when it happens. Got it! Oh my goodness! I was there the night Ray Allen broke Reggie's record. I was broadcasting that game. It was a huge thrill to be there. And it'll be a huge thrill to be in the building when Steph breaks Ray Allen's record. Tonight, the Warriors take on the Indiana Pacers, and Stephen Curry is only seven threes away from passing Ray Allen. It's just incredible to watch Steph. I think his greatness is at the level now where we just expect it. Maybe that's the true measure of greatness when you know, a guy can hit nine or ten threes and you don't even bat an eye because you've seen it before and you know you're going to see it again. Wanda Curry off the screen. Curry takes his time, lets it fly. Three ball. Hits up and good. There's one. Hands off to Curry. Slides to the right sideline. Jumper good. It's a three ball. His second of the night. Seems like maybe a couple times a year, there's a huge statistical barrier that Steph barrels through. And this year comes maybe the biggest one yet. Curry hits his fourth. Great testament to someone who is gifted, but who has earned everything through work, you know, beyond the gifts that he was given. Uh, he had to work so hard, and he's always been so uh, gracious and aware of how many people helped him along the way. It's one of my favorite things about him. On the cusp of history, the Golden State Warriors find themselves in New York City at Madison Square Garden as Steph Curry is now two away from setting the all-time three-point mark. I always feel like there's another level to get to. You know, I'm not afraid of the work that is necessary and that is required, knowing that it, it always comes back to the work that you put in, the confidence that you have in yourself, how you deal with failure, and you know that's always been something I've relied on, just getting to work and perfecting my craft. And I always have fun while I do it, so I think it's, you know, no matter how tough the obstacles were or you know how, how much I was overlooked coming up through the ranks or anything that you had to deal with you know, along the journey, I always just relied on, on the joy that basketball has brought to me and it's kind of kept me going. After 24 years and 13 seasons in the making, within a blink of an eye, it's showtime. New York taking on the Golden State Warriors. Take a look at the Warriors coming in, Jim. All the talk is about Steph Curry. Ray Allen is here, who's the current record holder for the most threes in NBA history. Reggie Miller is here. Steph's dad is here. Uh, it's, it's just a sort of a celebratory mood here tonight. Stephen Curry on the cusp of being the all-time three-point king. Curry down the floor. Needs one to tie. Takes the three straight on, and he is tied with Ray Allen. And for the moment, they share the throne and listen to the crowd here at the Garden. I'll tell you what, everyone in this arena is aware of it, aren't they, Tim? Yep. Everyone. Wiggins comes across, working on Fournier, up top to Curry, quick release, and splash! There it is! The best shooter the game has ever seen has cemented his legacy. No one has made more threes than Stephen Curry. And when you consider he has many more years in his career, he might be setting a record that may never be broken. There's a lot of people here tonight who he feels very strongly about, who have influenced him, and the fact that they're here with him tonight tells you everything about Steph. Not often do you have the opportunity to be around somebody who's the best ever at something. Because of him, I have an opportunity to go to work every day 
with someone who's the absolute best at what they do. And I don't take that for granted. I appreciate everybody that's had a part in me being who I am on the court, off the court. Like, this is a, a career milestone because of everybody that I got to suit up with, everybody that set screens for me, everybody that passed me the ball, everybody that believed in our offense and believed in winning in the process. So, um, this is truly special, man. Um, we got a lot more threes, a lot more wins, a lot more stuff to go, but I appreciate y'all making this special because this has been a long week trying to get up this <laughs> over this milestone. Having Reggie and Ray here was special, but nothing more special than everybody in this locker room. So let's keep this energy going. Yo. Man, this is a, a career milestone that I still got a lot more to go with. To you know I watched Ray when uh, he passed Reggie in Boston and I had this moment uh, at the Garden. This number right here has been on uh, been on my mind for a long time, so I'm gonna enjoy every minute of it and uh, and just know that uh, I'm the greatest three point shooter in the, in the history of the league. That's pretty special to say. I'm finally ready to say it, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Stephen, what are you going to be when you grow up? A basketball player. Boy, that's going to take a lot of hard work and practice. Anybody can play this game. Some of us will play it good. Others may even play great. Every once in a while, someone comes along who just plays it different. Step out of the head. He launches from deep. Good! They usually start off as an underdog. People call what they do crazy. But even after they're counted out, over and over, you soon realize they're not just playing the game, they're changing it. Curry splits the defense behind the back, fires a three, oh, he puts it in! You play your way, you stay true to your own voice, you change the game. Thanks for making the unbelievable possible. You've changed our community. You write poetry in motion, and I know every line by heart. You change our art. 是你让我爱上篮球，是你赋予体育更多的力量。You showed us how high our art could go. You changed the bay. You made this accessible to all of us, no matter who we are. You changed equality. You gave us unlimited range. You changed what's possible. You gave us craft, precision. You told us how to work. You changed what an athlete could be. You taught us the meaning of an inventor. You changed the standard. Steph, you changed the game in so many ways. What you gonna do next? It's impossible to, to really describe what Steph means to me. Yeah, he's just a special guy. He's one of one. Steph Curry never ceases to amaze in every way. Did Benjamin Button start old and get young? I think Steph Curry's that. He's kind of got an older spirit, and he seems to be getting younger, which is crazy. Curry to end the third. Makes it in! Well, Steph's greatness didn't happen overnight. This is a lifelong achievement. You can go anywhere in the world and you see Warriors blue or a gold jersey that has number 30 and you can ask anyone, they all know who Steph Curry is. You don't see many generational impactful players like, like a Steph Curry. He's special, he's a unbelievable talent and his leadership is incredible and he always sets the tone. He's one of the great players in NBA history. He's one of the great leaders. He makes the game look so effortless and so pretty. I watch Steph every day in practice. I'm a geek for this game. I love this game. I appreciate this game and I respect this game so much. So when you know I see someone trying to perfect their craft, 
not only trying, but they are perfecting their craft is beautiful to me. It's like music. It's a surreal feeling because I myself play the game the way that I know how to play and, and I've worked tirelessly at that craft. Continue to stretch my own creativity and imagination of what shots are you know, realistic to shoot and to make and continue to push that envelope every single year, knowing that it's, it's my comfort zone, but it's also something I never really imagined would have such an impact. And to know that the game has, has forever changed because of it is, you know, pretty surreal.